Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Rando Geek. All right, so I got the screen share up for you. I want to talk about this deal going on with T-Mobile. The article is coming from the T-Mobile report. I'll put the link for you down below in the description. If you're someone that likes to keep all your devices connected, T-Mobile has a good deal for Go 5G Next customers. Now this is apparently on the consumer and business side. So both sides can take advantage of this deal. So there is a uh, basically a breakdown here of the competition. So what T-Mobile is offering, it's for $5 a month. And we're going to see how that stacks up to Verizon and AT&T. So basically, if you're looking to jump on one of these carriers plans, you're not sure. Let's say you live in an area where all three carriers are very good for you. You can use T-Mobile, AT&T or Verizon, doesn't matter. You have great service everywhere. If you live in a highly populated city, where there's you know a lot going on, chances are you probably have good cell service because they try to keep it well lit because of the amount of traffic going on. If there's a lot of hotels, a lot of businesses, a lot of action, a lot of tourists, a lot of nightlife going on, like say a city like downtown Los Angeles or like a city like New York City, Manhattan, right? There's a lot going on in these areas. So usually your service will be good. Now it can be, of course, slow at times because of congestion, but overall, the service, the amount of action and connectivity and spectrum that's available to you will usually be great in larger cities. So anyway, uh, looks like T-Mobile will be streamlining this process. They're saying that if you have a Go 5G Next plan, this is quite a deal. So they announced this deal for Go 5G Next and Go 5G Business Next plans. It will include connectivity for additional devices like smartwatches, tablets, and laptops for just $5 per month per device. They're saying that this is a much cheaper alternative compared to AT&T and Verizon, what they're offering. They say they charge double to, to quadruple the price for connecting tablets and laptops. They're saying that this does not account for the cost of the base voice plan, though and that the $5 per month offer isn't available for the company's other plans, including Go 5G Plus. So it's just the Go 5G Next plan. So we gotta be transparent with that as well. All right, so here's the chart showing how they stack up against Verizon and AT&T. So this is a comparison of the Go 5G Next plan versus Verizon's Unlimited Ultimate and AT&T's Unlimited Premium plan. So as we can see here, here's what you're getting with Magenta what you're getting with Verizon and what you're getting with AT&T. So price breakdown, 100, 170, 180, 225. This is per line. So once you get up to four lines, the prices drop. Same thing with Verizon, 90, 160, 195, and 220. That's on four lines. Same thing with AT&T's Unlimited Premium. We have 86 for one line, 152, 183 and 204 for that fourth line. So more lines, more discounts. Estimated taxes and fees. Magenta, as of right now, not charging any on this plan. You'll get 350 per line with Verizon and 350 per line in taxes with AT&T. Three line total price. Magenta gives you your third line free. So it's 180 for three lines, it looks like. And then uh, 205.50 for... Verizon plus taxes and 193.50 plus taxes for AT&T. They're saying new and existing customers, same device offers. Always with, with uh, T-Mobile, only every three years to get the best deals with Verizon. And AT&T is not offering that. Streaming services. Apple TV Plus, Netflix, and Hulu available through Magenta. $10 a month will get you a streaming bundle through Verizon. AT&T... No, not offering streaming services like this right now. They, they back down from that. Uh, international data, five gigabytes high-speed data plus 215 countries with Magenta, 10 gigs of high-speed data in 200 plus 10 countries with uh, Verizon. So that's actually pretty good. A uh, little less amount of countries, but a little bit more high-speed data in the countries that you might be interested in. High-speed data, limited to 20 countries with AT&T. So definitely the least amount, the, the least favorite in that competition there. Canada, Mexico, unlimited talk, text, 
plus 15 gigs of high-speed data with Team Magenta, unlimited talk, text, plus 2 gigabytes of LTE per day with Verizon, and unlimited talk, text, and data at LTE speeds with AT&T. Device upgrade eligibility. T-Mobile is giving this to you every year, three years for Verizon and three years for AT&T. And now, Connect Wearables. Only $5 for Team Magenta, $7.50 per entry price with Verizon and $10.99 per entry price with AT&T. If you want to connect a tablet or a laptop, it's still $5 for T-Mobile, $10 for Verizon, and $20.99 with AT&T. So AT&T will give it to you, but you have to pay more. Uh, they're saying they're also offering a TCL link port, IK, IK511, which is their 5G USB-C device that connects directly to compatible compatible devices. This is 50 bucks for a limited time, which they're saying is half the price for Go 5G Next customers that are adding a $5 line. And they're saying that it's a near identical device made by TCL and can be seen in more detail on the TCL website. They're saying to note that the version T-Mobile will offer is apparently exclusive to T-Mobile. So the specific specifications and features will likely vary. So keep that in mind. Uh, they're also saying that they are upgrading device protection plans called Protection 360 to include unlimited claims for accidental damages and screen repairs at no extra cost. So yeah, if you have a Go 5G Next plan and you want to take advantage of this, you're someone that has multiple devices that you want to have connected up. This might be a good deal for you. As always, thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye for now.